Can you guys guess what I'm doing today by looking at my couches? <laughs> I have clothes all over them because I am so behind on laundry. And I only have one cake this week and I am so excited about that. And it's actually a cake for Xander's end of season baseball party which is on Sunday. And I did have a couple other people ask me to make them cakes this week. But I might have fibbed just a little bit and told them that I was booked because I need a break. After last week and all the stress that I went through last week um, and then next week I know it's just going to be just as busy, just as chaotic and stressful. I really, really wanted to take this week off because I need to get my house cleaned and organized and obviously laundry needs to be caught up. But as I'm cleaning, I came across this that Xander gave me on Mother's Day and I can't believe we forgot to show it to you guys, but I wanted to show it to you now because it's super cute. It says, my mom is my hero. As pretty as a flower, as sweet as a cake, as brave as a wolf pack, as smart as a scientist, as loving as a bunny. And there's him dressed as a superhero. Super cute. And I guess that's supposed to be me. I am talented, loving, um, friendly, helpful, brave, happy, funny, fair, nice, and fun. And it says, my mom the superhero. My mom is just like a superhero because she can make a good cake, make good cookies and cupcakes all in one day. So true. <laughs> My mom is so smart because that she knows this number, whatever that is, minus five. Even when my mom is tired, she still makes cakes, cookies, and even cupcakes. Still true. <laughs> my mom is as beautiful as a butterfly and as sweet as sugar. I love my mom so much because she is the number one mom in the world. That is so sweet. So I always keep everything that the kids make me for special holidays like this. And I always write the year. I put Mother's Day 2017 on the back of it. So whenever I look at it, several years from now, I'll remember the year that it was made. And obviously I'll remember who it's from because Xander's picture is right there on the front of it. So I bought something else for Xander's room today to hold all of his game balls in, which I know he has more than what is here right now, but I think a lot of them are in his baseball bag. So we need to dig them out. But I saw this idea on Pinterest and it's super cute. So I just bought a giant mason jar. This is like the gallon size. And it says ball on it, which is perfect, obviously. And then I put his game balls in there. And this is what I'm using for Jacob's game balls. This is the basket that we won at the raffle at Xander's Spring Fun Day. I need to repaint this because I thought it was just chalk, but it's not. So I need to repaint this with chalk paint, which I have and then right on their game balls. But for now, I'm turning it backwards <laughs> and it still works and it's super cute. We're on our way to baseball. Game two of the end of season tournament for this guy. He's busy with fidget spinners back there. Of course, are you ready for game two? Yeah. This game is going to be harder than yesterday because we are playing the Astros who beat us last So during the season, during the season, we won one, we tied one, we lost one. No way. Against the Astros? Hang on, wait. We played four times. Did we beat them twice? Yeah. We beat them twice, we tied once, and they won the last game that we played. By a lot. Yeah, <laughs> four to 14. They whooped us. So now we're going to play them tonight. So obviously it's going to be a hard game, and hopefully our boys are going to be here to play hard. Um, and even if we lose today, which I hope that we don't, we're not out because it's a double elimination. That means if we lose today, we have to play Friday against the Astros no, again. No, no, against the Red Sox. Let's see who we play because they've only lost sure? one. Yeah, because this, whoever loses this game plays okay. against the Red Sox, who gotcha. we just beat. But if we win this game, then we make it to the championship game on Saturday because there's only three teams in our division. So, wish us luck, So, I, is that how it actually works, though? Is it, they don't want a championship for the National League side and for the American League side? Yes, it's not like a combine. they don't combine them. Really? Because I thought that they did. I thought we'd be playing the Dodgers. Really? That's really. not smart. So because the other side only had one other. Teams. It was just two, two teams. teams. That's just dumb. Yeah. Well, Sorry about that, but that's just dumb. That it makes no dumb. sense. When <laughs> so, I was wrong. <laughs> okay. Woo. Okay, so, he was correct. The National and American leagues play together like the winner of each side will play each other 
for the actual shape. And that's a single elimination of that one. Correct. They don't have like because so even if you made it all the way through yours and was undefeated at the championship game, that one's a single elimination. Really? You don't have to beat them twice. That's what it looks like here. It doesn't it. break off. I don't know. It's confusing. <laughs> no, it's so just it's one single necessary. game. It's yeah. one single game. And because the reason I thought that it would be over by the Saturday is because that was the end of the brackets. But then there's like an extended bracket that was on a different page for the actual championship game. So, which is next is Thursday. Like Hopefully, we make it there and play the Dodgers. Hey, by that time. The All Stars will have been announced too, nice. so we'll get to find out if Mr. Xander makes an All Star team or not. Xander, Xander. Uh, I mean, Xander. That's what they said the last All Stars. Xander. <laughs> I forgot. Jacob went on a field trip today. Where did you go? The middle or the um, junior high that going to next year. Nice. How did it go? Oh, good. Are you excited? Yeah. What'd you say about the the kids that go there? They look like they're in high school or like in college. They look so old for their age. Did you see Logan? Nope. <laughs> Logan doesn't look that old. Logan looks He's like... He's tall though. Yeah. Compared to Jacob, like if you see them side by side, Logan's... Junior high. In like three weeks, we're going to have a junior high And student. a third grader. And a third grader. What do you think about that? It's happening way too fast. They, way they grow, too they grow fast. up way too fast. You know, when you become an adult, when you have to do the uh, hashtag adulting thing, it... <laughs> well, it just flies by. Right? Yeah. It's like you don't have any time. It's like you want more time. Like that's what I w always talk about. I want a longer weekend. The days need to be longer. I just can't get enough stuff in. I mean, I'm I'm dead tired by the end of the day, and I've and I've stayed up till eleven o'clock at night. <laughs> Jacob says he knows what you mean by adulting. Oh yeah, totally. I'm yeah, sure he does. Yeah, I know how it goes. You know. Yeah, you like to pay those bills. Oh, that's expensive. Mm, yeah, it is. <laughs> Pre-game warm-ups. Good. There you go. You see, when you do that, your bat's a lot faster. Do it again. Hey, but you're not, you're not driving your hips, but swing with some authority, like you're mad. Good. There it is. Game time. Xander got moved go, up to Xander. second batter. Bring that run home. Come on, buddy. Aggressive, buddy. Aggressive. Bring, bring Wide stance. Home. Run out, run out. There you go. Good job, Xander. That's all right, Xander. RBI. Again, RBI, buddy. Good job, Xander. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we are back home. 
It was a good game, huh? It was. Two triple plays in one game. One from our team and one from the other they team. It's all our team. That was crazy. Like, our triple play, it was pretty legit, okay? The, uh, the pitcher caught the line drive, threw it to first, threw it to second. Legit triple play. Their triple play, okay. not going to take away from it as a triple play, but we had some really bad base running going on at that time. One of our kids, instead of running back to first, decided to run to the outfield. <laughs> He I don't tried, know what he was he thinking. He tried to avoid the tag, but then you're out of the baseline. <laughs> he, was, he was in the outfield, in right field, trying to run around, oh. trying to dodge the, the, no, the, out the ball. Yeah. Well, he was out either way. He, he called him out because he was way out of the baseline. He was out yeah. the outfield. <laughs> but we played good. Xander moved up to the number two spot in the order, which he did really well. His coach said he's going to leave it like that. He's pretty positive. because He didn't hit no. well, the thing, the, he got some face. The thing the coach likes about it is, he barrels it up, even though he's not like driving into the outfield. It, he's getting a solid contact, and he usually hits it into the ground. And he's fast enough that it's that's fine hitting it into the ground because he can outrun a lot of stuff. So coach said he liked it. He's gonna leave him there. Uh, so he's the number two hitter right now. Um, I, I he, he had a couple plays at catcher where he probably could have had some outs, but we the sun was in the eyes of the, everybody that was playing on the left side of the field, and we missed the ball a couple times there. But that was he, he had good throws. I was I was I was liking what he was doing throwing the ball. Um, what else can I report from this game? We won. Yep, we won again. Yeah, we needed this win. Uh, that was the team that beat us last time, 14 to four. Um, the other catcher that plays on the team, he actually threw somebody out at third and had a play at home to get an out as well. And I guess last but not least, we won, which means we're still in the winner's bracket. That's awesome, right? So when's our next game? Um, Saturday. Saturday, which means there's gonna be a lot of baseball coming your way on Sunday because we film and then put the video up the next day. Jacob has a tournament and Xander has a, uh, has a game on Saturday, so Sunday's vlog is gonna be baseball packed. Uh, which Saturdays will too, but it's gonna be more or less practice footage. That's what, that's what we have usually from Fridays. I made a new pitch spinner. Let me show them. Who, made, who, who made this? I started no, it. No, you came up with the idea, I but I, made, I just made this fidget no. spinner right here. I used six zip ties. You can see four in the middle, smaller ones, and then two on the outside. And it works really good. I did a pretty good job, I think. I could probably make a tutorial on this at some point. You should. Don't you guys think so? If you think I should make a tutorial on how to make this, on leave a comment below. Today. I could. It could be one video of just like, how do you make a five spinner, a four spinner, and a three spinner? Oh, I could make a one spinner. Yeah. Hand me that bearing right there real quick. Let me show them how to make this. Um. Here's a one spinner. And I can make a two spinner. Oh yeah? Or you just go like this, like this. Sure. So leave a comment below if you want us to make those fidget spinners and, and we'll make that an extra video. That, that might be kind of good, I think. I think that's it for today. We're gonna go ahead and close this out now. I'm gonna finish watching the, the Astros game where we're dominating right now. It's, I think, what was the score? Is it 10 to two right now? Yes, now we're about to watch the same one. Oh, never mind. Boys are about to go to bed, and we're gonna watch some Shameless because we're 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 getting caught up. We're almost there, huh? All right. So hopefully you enjoyed it. Make sure you leave a thumbs up if you haven't ever done it before. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, and we will see you guys and gals tomorrow.